Well, I, I think there's a tradition in, um, in Judaism of uh, intellectual uh, uh, studies, intellectual occupation, uh, occupying ourselves with the, in the mind. We have a saying that says, the Talmud Torah Kaneged Kulam. The, the most important activity and this is apparent from the Talmud also, the absolutely the most important thing in Judaism is study of the Torah. And uh, uh, this transcends, transcends everything, uh, uh, everything else, yes. Uh, there's, there's, we say every morning we have a whole list of obligations that we have to do, and then it says, the Talmud Torah connected kulam. The Talmud Torah is is uh, equal or, or exceeds in importance all the other things to even put together. Yes. So uh, in in Judaism, uh, in in other um, societies, the uh, the the daughter of the rich man, a rich man. Um, uh, marries off his daughter to a the son of another rich man. Um, in in Judaism, the rich man ma marries off his daughter to a scholar, uh, even a poor scholar. He goes to the to the academy, to the Talmudical academy, and he says, "Who's your best student?" Yes, and the the uh, the head of the Talmudical Academy says, "So and so is my best student." So he picks him out to marry off his. And this has a, this has an effect. The the it, it even has a genetic effect. Possibly, I'm not sure about that, but possibly it has a genetic effect because that way the the genes of the of the best students uh, um, get uh, propagated uh, uh, more easily, and. Uh, and so, so that is, but, but more important than the genetic effect is perhaps the traditional effect. There's a tradition in Judaism of intellectual activity, and specifically of Torah study, but it has spilled over also to areas other than Torah study, simply to all study, to all intellectual activity. And, uh, and that, that is the tradition, and, uh, and that, uh, that, Gives it sign in in um, in uh, it makes itself felt in in all uh, areas of intellectual endeavor.